admitting this half term doesn't feel much like a holiday, does it? You are feeling like this is just another slog, that you are tired, that you are sick of exams and you just want this to be over. It nearly is. It is nearly, nearly over. Um, and I know you're tired. I know you're tired. You've done a load, a load of exams and the kind of exam fatigue is starting to set in. Um, you've been working so, so hard and there's, I know sometimes it's really hard to see where the end is, but I promise you it is coming. So we are halfway through the holidays. Um, I, I just want to apologise that I haven't done as much recently as I was planning to. I was planning on live streaming um, loads, but um, if you've been following my Instagram stories, then you'll see that I've been spending a large amount of time um, with the baby in hospital. Um, so I'm sorry that I haven't been able to do as much time for you, much stuff. I haven't had as much time to do live streams and videos for you as possible. So I'm really sorry about that. But um, I just want to say that what I want to say to you in this video is that it is really important that you take a bit of a break over this holiday. Um, I know this is coming out like halfway through the holidays, so you, maybe you're already taking a break. Maybe you're um, maybe you need to start working again. But it is important to take a break. So don't slog yourself every single day studying hours and hours and hours. Don't um, stay up really late every single night. Don't get up early every single morning. Don't spend the whole holiday doing nothing but working. It is really, really important that you take a break. If you're um, not sure how much time you should be spending studying, just look at your school timetable and then try and stick to that as much as you can. For the things like um, arts, where maybe you've already done your exams, drama, where you've already done your exams, or ones where you've done the majority of the exams, just replace these with other subjects, think about replacing the high priority subjects like maths. Um, oh, the kittens are over there hissing at each other. Stop it. Uh, Prim is not getting on with the new kittens at all. She she is not happy about being usurped as the baby of the family. Um, there's a little bit of hissing going on. Anyway, what was I saying? Um, yeah, we have, when we get back, um, two weeks, maybe for some of you three weeks of exams, and I know these are chocked full, absolutely rammed full of exams, and then it will be over. So, I know, like, I know what has just come out on Netflix, I know there's a new season of 13 Reasons Why, and I am absolutely desperate to watch it. I also know that I don't have time to watch it at the moment. So I just have in my head 15th June, 15th June, 15th June when the last physics exam is. And then the 20th June when the last A-level chemistry exam is. And then when they're over, I'm going to take a night and I'm going to sit down and I'm just going to watch the whole thing. And I have a whole list of things stored up that I'm going to do when... Um, everything calms down a bit when I'm doing less tutoring, when I'm doing less videos, summer holiday, I'm kind of like two, three weeks away, I cannot wait until it is here. Um, and that's what you need to do, you need to realise that summer holidays, that long, 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 fantastic summer holiday, isn't actually that far away, it's um, so, so close, you need to start storing up things to do. Shall I get you a kitten? I'll get you a kitten. Look, you can have all three of them. Prim, she looks so big now. And then the two little ones. Um, people that come over to my house to be cheated, literally get to sit here cuddling a kitten while we do physics. Apparently it's really, really stress relieving. Um, this is Ada, she's super cute. But they are um, very bouncy. What was I saying? Um, yes, it is nearly over guys, plan what you need to do for summer holiday, plan things that you're going to enjoy for summer holiday, just make a list, stick it up on the wall, um, keep thinking about how amazing it's going to be, but wait until the summer, don't spend hours binging on Netflix now, wait until the summer and do it then, because you do need to spend the time revising. Um, it's nearly over guys, I'm so so proud of how hard all of you have been working, you've been doing such 
an amazing, fantastic, brilliant job. Um, we will get through this all together, so good luck, guys. Ouch. Mm, I'll be too prim.